I'm voting for because it's a secret ballot. <laughs> but the, the, the good news is Michelle said she voted for me. And I've come to Virginia today to ask you for your vote, just 12 days from now. I need your vote. I've come to ask for your help in keeping America moving forward. You've now seen three debates, months of campaign events, and way too many TV commercials. So you've heard what the argument's about here. You understand what the choice is. You've heard Governor Romney's sales pitch. He's been running around, no, no, don't boo, vote. He, he's been running around saying he's got a five-point plan for the economy. Turns out it's a one-point plan. Outsource. Folks at the very top get to play by a different set of rules than you do. They, they get to pay a lower tax rate. They get to outsource jobs. They, they want to roll back Wall Street reforms that we put in place to make sure we don't have taxpayer-funded bailouts. That was his philosophy in the boardroom. That was his philosophy as governor. And if it sounds familiar, it's because that's exactly what we tried in the last decade. Before I came into office, it led to falling incomes and record deficits and the slowest job growth in half a century and the worst economic crisis since the Great Depression. We have now been working for four years to clean up the mess those policies left behind. And, and now, now Governor Romney wants to take us back to those policies, but he knows that they're probably not very popular. He knows his plan isn't any different than the policies that got us into trouble. So, in the final weeks of this election, uh, he's counting on you forgetting. He, he's hoping that you come down with a case of what we call Romney. He's hoping you won't remember that his economic plan is more likely to create jobs in China than it is in America because it actually rewards companies that ship jobs and profits overseas. He's hoping you won't remember that he wants to give millionaires and billionaires a $250,000 tax cut because the only way he can pay for that tax cut is by raising your taxes or blowing a hole in the deficit. Hell no! He's hoping that you'll come down with a severe case of Ron before you cast